Well, good morning, Donna. Good morning. Good morning, Gay. Good morning, this Bob. Is pretty exciting over here this morning, isn't very it? Very exciting. We're here for another um, Memorial Day Parade, 2017 Memorial Day Parade. Wow. And this is very exciting. We're going live today. This is our first year. It is our very first year of going live. We'd like to thank DATV for setting this all up for us and and everyone who's running everything here. This is great. Yep, the guys are out here. The cameras are ready to go. Yes. We have been on the air doing this for, what, 15 12, 15 years at now? At least, But yeah. this is our first year going live. We're very excited about that. It we'll is. Be able so to watch the parade as they're coming up the road. That's Absolutely. really awesome. Absolutely. So let's tell everybody our names. I'm Donna Lanier. I'm Gay Corey. And uh, we, we also have with us Bob Corey, who's sitting off in the corner. He's over here. He just gets to watch today. And we also have our man on the street, Mike, Mike Portress, Portress yeah. who we'll be hearing from in a little <coughs> bit. So, Gay, what did you do this morning in preparation? Well, this morning we got up very early, and then we went over to the police department, and we covered their ceremony over there. And then we went to the fire station and covered their ceremony and over there awesome. and then we came over here and uh here we are just waiting for the parade to come our way okay and now we're going to go over to mike don't he's going to no not yet, no, not yet. No. oh sorry no. not yet okay. we're still going to be talking here he's getting ready to go off and to start talking to people out in the street who are lining up all right the crowds aren't too big this uh so far this morning it's a little chilly it is chilly out here a little today. breezy it's still a little early um we are located here on Lakeview Avenue, up by the uh, Gunther Corner, and um, well, where we always are. Yeah, we've been here for quite a while. But usually, we're standing in the street rather than. We have a really good <coughs> vantage point here, so we, we can do. see everybody coming right up the street. This is excellent. And, uh, the crowd is a little thin, unfortunately, but hopefully, people are watching us at home. Yes, and we'll <coughs> get to see uh, what's going on. So yeah, we're live. It's hard to believe, huh? This is fun. <laughs> okay. All right. So, so, all right. Now we're going to Mike Poitras. Memorial Day, and uh, having a great day today. And and I and I found some people that are getting ready for the parade. And your name is Jalen. Jalen, you having fun yet? Yes. A little chilly out here today, right? Yeah. Right. And this is Gabby. Gabby, and who's this? Mabel. Mabel. Hey, Mabel. Mm -hmm. Mabel's enjoying the parade. Doesn't care about it being cold out. And what's your name? Aiden. Aiden. Okay, you guys, I want to hear some good cheering when the when the parade comes by. You guys are live on Drake at Access Television today. All right? Hi, Meme. <laughs> All right, that's right. Say hi to Meme because, you know, Christmas is right around the corner. And um, and I, I think that's it for right now. We're going to send it back to, the, to Gay and Donna. All right, well, thanks, Mike. That was great. We, Look forward to hearing those kids cheering as they as the parade starts and come up. So Drake it has actually had a parade for gosh, how many years? Oh, I'm talking boy. more than fifty. Oh, at least at least at right. Least, I remember yes. seeing it when I was a kid, and the same route from Greenmont down Greenmont Avenue. But I can remember they had uh, acts in the street then, and they had uh, horses. We had the horses come down and. Uh, the uh, wagon, they used to drive the wagon down the street with the horses. Yes, they did. That yep. was a lot of fun. But, but it's been the same route for it all these years. For all so these years. everybody <coughs> in town who have been here all this time have their little select spot to stay. They do. They and, come. And watch it. They, have they bring their chairs. They bring and their chairs and their families. And you, it's fun to see how the families have grown over the years. It's really nice sitting here because we can see all the way down the avenue now I where... Before we were limited to the Gunther's Corner, That's but we right. can see all the way down to the street. Yep, just just at the curve of uh, Old yeah. Road. Yeah, that's wow. This is that very is exciting. quite quite the uh, vantage point. This is very exciting. It is to actually. be live on DATV. And Thank we you sure very hope much. you're all watching at home, because it should be a great day, in spite of the cold. But it's okay. It, that's okay. It is uh, the end of May, of course. And, and it's we should not be raining. And it's not raining. We should, uh, <laughs> yes. it should be a little bit warmer. <laughs> I know there have been more in many years where it has been warmer, but we'll take it. At least it's a, it's a nice day to see people come out and enjoy themselves. It is. And, and uh, I guess we'd like to thank Knits and Knots for supplying us with some hand warmers. Little fingerless hand yes. mittens. Um, they saw us sitting here at the booth and 
both our hands were a little cold, so <laughs> a lovely colors, lady yes. um, came up and, and handed us some handmade uh, hand warmers. Yes, so she did, and we're they very are excited nice about hosting. <laughs> yeah, we are. <laughs> very nice. So I guess we'll just wait for the uh, parade. So to a little come. bit about the parade route. Oh no, we're going to take it over to Mike. He's got some more people to talk to. Go ahead, All Mike. All right, go ahead, Mike. Hi everybody, We're here we are uh, on the parade route waiting for the parade to come by and I found uh, a couple of friends here to join us for Drake at Access Television live today and I'm with Lynn. Hi, how are you? Very good. Very and this good. is Bryn. Say hi, honey. Hi, Bryn. You gonna be shy? Say hi. Say hi. Say hi. You wanna say hi to William? He's marching in the parade. Oh, uh, your brother? Yep, oh. brother yep. oh, and what's he do? What's he gonna do in the parade? He's a Cub Scout. Cub Scout, yeah. sweet. Daddy's a police officer. Oh, wonderful. Yes. Wonderful. Can't wait for them to come up. They should be coming up uh, I don't know, I soon, hopefully. And they were starting, so. Oh, great, great. Yep. And you're having a good time so far? Yes, we're having a great time. Yes. Good that the rain's holding out, too. Right? Yeah, <laughs> we, we've been watching the radar and hoping. I, I think it's going to hold up. It actually seems pretty nice right now. It seemed a lot colder this morning when we got here. It did. Very good, yes. I like, I like you guys. It all uh, <laughs> decorated up nice. Yes. Our hus my husband's a veteran too in the Marines, so oh, yes, a lot of people in our family, so oh, very thankful, right? Great. Well, well, well Bryn, hi, did you want to say hi to everybody in Drake it? Say hi, honey. Can you say hi? Say hi. It's like, no, I'll say hi I'll, I'm good with this lollipop. <laughs> right. <laughs> she'll, she'll talk our ear off after we yeah, leave, but. She waves everybody along the road, yeah. <laughs> well, thank you for joining us on Drake it Access Television. All right, thank you. And we're going to send it back to Donna and Gay. Mike, that was very that was very good. She looked like she was very content over there with her lollipop. I loved her little headdress. I with did the too. The little feathers and the red, white, and blue. She, she was, was just very chilling festive. out with those little he sunglasses. <laughs> Hope she has a great time on the parade. And I guess the view that you heard, they're started kicking off, so they'll be heading down again the, the route, Cremont Avenue to Pleasant Street, and turning up Lakeview Avenue and ending over at the memorial yeah. at, the, at the, high the high school. Yeah, where there's a There'll be a little ceremony, There'll be a little over ceremony there. there as we thank our veterans and re remember, especially yes. those who did not come home. And um, that's why we're here to thank our veterans for their service. Well, that's what Memorial Day is all about. That's absolutely uh, to remember those who gave the ultimate price. Absolutely. And you know, it used to be called Decoration Day. That was, I believe, oh. after Civil War. <coughs> when and did it change to uh, Memorial Day? Hmm. Now hmm. you got me there. All right. Well, but I'm glad it did. I'm because I, I, I would because much rather uh, memorialize and remember those who gave everything for us because we owe them so much for, for our freedom, for our freedom and allowing us to come out here and enjoy and we a lovely day, even if it's, you know, if it's a, a little, little brisk cloudy and brisk, it's, uh, we are still, our feet hit the floor this morning and yeah, we're out here <laughs> celebrating, or not I celebrating, but enjoying the I day. I actually so. put the heat on at home. I refuse. I'm not oh, doing no. that. No. No, no my no. heat's on. I have to be toasty. <laughs> <laughs> That's what they made blankets for. <laughs> you know I, mean? I have that too. <laughs> Electric. <laughs> I'm glad. I'm glad yeah. you're, you're nice and warm. Babe. <laughs> there would, there would really just, if I had to stop you from shaking all I, day, we'd be in real big I trouble. Know, I know. I <laughs> know. My knees are knocking together over here. <laughs> So this is a good vantage point. And we like oh, to sit. I see other people. I've got some more family members showing oh, up I there. See, they wave down to them. Hi. Is that Our, your sister? That is my aunt. Oh, my aunt. two aunts. Yeah, my mother's sisters. Um, oh. we, we, my family has come down to this end for a well, long, time. A, long time. Well, you've got a good I've, group down there, I Donna. I do. Yes, I do. They always like to uh, come out, watch the parade. It's uh, something that my family has been part of for many, 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 many years. Uh, my family's well, we always been in always We been used in to town. come here as kids, yep. too. So. I mean, I've been in Drake it all my life, so. So did I. I have been in Drake it all my life. Did you go to Drake at schools? I did. I went through Drake at schools. I mm. uh, started out as Jean Duc as a young in elementary school, but then went transferred over to Drake at schools and graduated from Drake at high school. Me, too. Um, actually celebrating a... Um, Milestone reunion year this Ooh. year. Um, do we want to? Do we yeah, want to mention? Sure, why not? Age is only a number. Um, <laughs> I've been out of school 40 years this year. 
Okay. So we'll be having a uh, class of 77 reunion. Stay tuned for all wow. those members of the class of 77. Stay tuned for some Now, are most details. of your classmates around here, or are they all scattered They're everywhere? They're scattered. They're scattered yeah. all over, but thanks to Facebook. Yeah. Uh, we get to catch up every once in a while and talk with each other. That's so I see great. A lot, I see a lot still in town. Do you? Oh, sure. And uh, I work at the middle school, as you know, and I see a lot of their kids <laughs> coming through. Oh. So that's kind of scary, too. <laughs> kind of makes you feel a little little older when you see the kids and, and they're graduating. Yeah, that's you right. Know? Yes, that's right. Yep. Because uh, I can remember when they were little. When they were little, little. Yes. Little, little. Yep. Does that mean we're getting older? No. But no. Like I said, <laughs> age is just a number. This is I, true. This yep. is true. It's Look, I uh, see there's more people coming right yeah, now as we speak. Yeah, it's starting to fill in. It's starting to fill in a lot. We're... Uh, we're seeing more and more people. Yeah. They haven't started coming up here nope. yet, so. This is great. We have this monitor so we can see way down the street before they even come around the bend, so. That's right. This is terrific. This is a very good. Very it nice. is. Look at you and your glasses on. I all know. sparkly and blingy. I feel so festive. <laughs> Thank you, Mike Poitras. He gave me these I know, glasses. We have all our decorations he, yeah, on Mike, today. Yeah, Mike decorated us this morning. He did, in case yes. You <laughs> yeah. I had a different outfit picked out, but it got too cold to wear it. So, yeah, yeah. I had short We're sleeve too. Well, that was a yeah. quick change. That of was a quick change pose. outfit yeah. for that. <laughs> Absolutely. <laughs> but we've uh, we're still out here having fun. Yes, you know, I saw uh, a gentleman this morning. He had um, a purple heart, and uh, that's uh, Pat Waller. Oh, nice. Pat Waller. He was at uh, the fire station. And, and a bronze star as well. And a bronze star as well. Mm -hmm. Wow. Wow. And My I know we do off. have a World War II veteran today. Wow. Um, yeah. In fact, Bob and I had interviewed him a few months back, and he's a very, very interesting man. His name is Frank. Um, uh, um, have a little trouble <laughs> saying his last name there, but yes. Paulo, Paulo. Where is it? Is it on here? It was on here, Frank. He's at, the, oh, he's at <laughs> it's the, gr oh, the, the Grand, Grand Marshal. Oh, Paul Warzik. That's it. Okay. That's it. He's nice. He's to say. That's, I don't know. <laughs> but Not anyway, really. he's he's going to be the Grand Marshal this year. And last year he was planning on it, but then we got rained out, so. Well, that's awesome. Yeah. I know that's the greatest generation is, you know, yeah, when you think starting, how many to, years. starting to leave us. And, oh, I know. You know. It's sad. It is, oh, it is I hear. I hear, I hear them, them. I hear them. I hear them. I hear the sirens off in the distance. Traffic's starting to pick up a little bit, which means everybody's trying to find a good spot to go. Well, that's good. Oh, oh Mike's got his schedule now. We gave now. Mike the schedule, so, <laughs> so he's ready. He can now talk about upcoming things. Mm. And he's going to, I think we're going to go to him pretty soon. Are we going to Mike now? And, um, and we're going back to Mike right now. Okay, we're still on the parade route, waiting for the parade to come up the road here in Draken on a beautiful day, right? Not too cold out. I'm down to my regular shirt. And I found a friend, another friend here, and his name is Luke, and he wants to say hi to somebody. Hi. Say hi to everybody in Draken. Hi. Wasn't there a certain teacher at the Inglesby you wanted to say hi to? Um, Inglesby. And what's your teacher's name? Mrs. West. Okay. Well, Mrs. West? Well, there uh -huh. you go. Um, he's looking for A's next week, so there, there you go. A anybody else you'd like to say hi to? Mm, Anthony Schoenfeldt, my best buddy. Oh, awesome. Now, what do you think about today's, today's Memorial Day parade? Love it. Love it. You know what it's all about? Yeah. Yep, we're, we're saying saying thank you to all of the men and women that served and, and died for serving our country. Uh-huh. That's right. And we're very proud of you guys coming out and, and being a part of the celebration. Yeah. All right. Well, Luke, anything else you'd like to add? No. Beth Lavasser. Okay, we'll see Beth uh, Friday night. We'll be we'll be doing the shoot down at uh, down at the high school graduation. Hopefully, we won't get any rain. Okay, so that's it for for here on the parade route. We're gonna send it back to Donner and Gay. And uh, oh, 
And we're and back. And we are back. We are and we'll back be getting ready to, uh, the parade should be coming up shortly. I see. I see. They're on their way. It looks like somebody's coming. I hear the sirens. I hear the sirens, and the, the traffic is now starting to get s scant, yes, which it means is. they've They're uh, closing off starting the to close avenue. off the star uh, side streets to the avenue so that the parade can come up. And it looks like uh, the crowd has started to fill in a little bit down on Lakeview Avenue, down towards uh, St. Marguerite. It does. As we're filling in an old, uh, old road. And yeah, the I crowds are coming up a little bit. It's you can see them at the end of the street here. It's a little breezy tonight. Yeah, there they are. They're getting ready. Oops, see Everybody over here. We over have they're filling in all, they're the, filling uh, in all, all the, the spots all over all here. The spots over here. Everybody <laughs> brought their family and the kids. Nice to see the kids out. It is. And I know Mr. Gunther is um, in the parade himself. He's going to be bringing his fire truck. Oh, I the old it. fire truck. Yeah, oh, I saw him this morning. He was at uh, the the fire ceremony. Yep. Fire department. So he said he'll be it's in. Always nice to see Mr. Gunther back in the parade. I know. He, he's been bringing that truck for quite a few years. Yes, he has. Well, he was a volunteer firefighter, I believe, at one point. At time. one point. Yes. I guess he was, yes. And he's... A staple of town. He Any summer day is. you can walk by and see the garage doors open and see Mr. Gunther, Bud Gunther, in his garage, yeah. hanging out there, I think he had, working. Did he have peacocks or um, guinea hens maybe? Guinea hens. Guinea hens. I think it was guinea hens, yeah. I think everybody in town had some sort of animal animals <laughs> at one time. My <laughs> yeah. grandfather used to have goats. Oh, really? He had chickens. He had rabbits. We had a sh uh, ram. At one point, we had a duck. Yeah. <laughs> the ram didn't like my grandmother. Oh, that's no. too bad. <laughs> no, that was too bad. Yeah, every time she went to hang the wash out, he used to <laughs> bump her legs. Oh, so yeah. And uh, look, look at here's our new van. There's the DATV truck. It the is. Guys up on top, running the cameras. And who's up there? I don't I know. I can't see Mike, behind. Mike and Tyler, I believe. I believe it is. There. Yes. And uh, Gary's inside, running things with Ron Zimmerman and. Uh, Look at what a nice looking van that is. Very nice. Since and now we're going to go see the inside oh of the Oh, there they There's are. Ron. There's Gary and, and Ron. Ron. Great Running job. The show. Great job. Great Look job, you guys. This is a very, very nice van. We've got all the equipment inside here. and uh, They've been Bob doing a lot of the sporting events, which is awesome. It is that, awesome. That the, uh, that the uh, kids can see themselves and th see the game played after... Yep, Bob um. and I took the uh, the course on how to run the equipment in there. Although we don't usually do games, so but yep. but it's still nice to see. In fact, in the summertime we go down and do the uh, Lowell Folk Festival, and we take our van down there and we go live from there. So that's that's a fun time. That's always it. Really is. There's yep. a lot. There's a lot to see down there and good food. Oh yeah, yeah. Lots good dancing, good, good music. Sure. No matter where you go, sometimes the food choices though too many. Uh, too many food choices. I never know. What well, there's there's food on every corner. <laughs> that's the problem. Yeah, <laughs> and there's too many food choices though. That's I, I never know what to do. It depends where I am. Depends what venue I I'm hanging out at. I did at get at my hair braided by a lady from I th believe she was from Africa, and she said that uh, when you get your hair braided, it means something. Okay. I, I, and you don't remember what go, it meant. I didn't go any <laughs> further with that, so. <laughs> it meant yeah. that you're a very special lady. Yes, yes How's that's that? exactly what it meant. <laughs> lovely braids in your hair. Yes, yes, absolutely. Did you get some beads, too? Um, actually, I did get beads. Nice. Yeah, the church was giving out free rosary beads, and they were giving out free necklaces. Nice. And yeah. Always a fun time. Free medals. and. Yep. Oh, it was always nice. A, always a great time when we go to uh, the Folk Festival. We're very fortunate in this area. We are, because there's... Not only that, that but we have, we have the lakes here, we have the ocean, we have the mountains. I mean, we're, we're midway to pretty much everything. We you can know, go anywhere. Right, anywhere within an hour. Hit the mountains. It's great. Drake, it's that nice little quiet town tucked away in uh, northern Massachusetts. But we get around. But we get <laughs> <laughs> the, only one, the, the only one on the map in the, <laughs> in the world, Drake. It That's was very true. lucky. And uh, then we have our parade coming up or just we do just and the sirens we are getting the sirens. closer yep hopefully I that's the them. parade sirens and yeah uh, yeah not, not something else right. not something else 
Did you ever go for a ride in the fire truck? I have. Did you? I have. I have yeah. not. Um, my uh, former husband was in the military, and we lived at Fort Devens. So oh. So Armed Forces Day, we used to be able to go on the, all the equipment. Oh. Okay, so... Okay. The lineup. Gay, right, why don't you give us a lineup for the Memorial Day Parade today? Okay, so this is how we're going to start it with the uh, Drake's Finest. Our police department will be coming up first, and then our fire department will be following them, and then our local officials, town manager and... I believe um, Allison Hughes will be walking as well. She's the, the chairman of the selectmen. The selectmen and, and the, the school committee, and the right? Oh, and the school committee also. Anybody else? I don't. I um, think that's that's it for the representative. Officials. Gary may be there. She she has been oh, known she to might march be. in the parade. Yep. Yeah. And then we have then we have the grand marshal, which will be Frank. And that's Frank uh, Polwarzik. Polwarzik. Yep. And then we have the Drake High School marching band. They're always, always very good. Always love listening always to the marching band. Funny thing is, is my son was, um, he was in that band when he went to Drake at High. I still have his uniform. Wow. <laughs> yeah, it does not fit him anymore. <laughs> but <laughs> What do you do with those uniforms? Can you return them and let somebody else I use them? I guess. I don't know if they've changed. I'm sure they've changed I, I over the years. I think we're using the same uniforms. I think they've changed over the years. <laughs> and Mike Poitras is in front of us posing. <laughs> <laughs> so then following the marching band will be the uh, veterans and vehicles. And, all the, yeah. uh, and then the American Legion float and with I've members of the Legion and the auxiliary. I, I, would I believe that. Pat yep. Waller is going to be on that one. <laughs> he was out raising money for the uh, uh, Memorial Day. He was over at uh, one of the local stores, and he said he raised $700 for That's the Legion. awesome. Yeah, he's, That's he's really tremendous. That's really great. And then we have the uh, Drake at Public Schools. We'll be represented by a couple of the elementary schools, the Greenwine Avenue Elementary and Brookside. the Brookside Elementary. And, that, and then we have, oh, and then we have Whispering Brook Farm Horse Drawn Hearse. Well, that's a new one. That is a new one. That is that will be interesting we to see. We look forward to seeing that. We do. And uh, the Lions Club of Drakeit. And then we have the uh, New Liberty Jazz Band will be coming up. And the Drakeit Girls Softball, the Guiding Light Dancing Academy. And then always, always fun is the Jim Kin Kilroy's Jambalaya Jazz Band. That, I love a good jazz band. They well, have a lot. Yep. That'll get our feet moving that over here. You certainly know. will. Get the blood circulating. That certainly it's will. It's yes. chilly over here. Yep. So we have the... And, uh, oh, I, Donna, I see yep. our first vehicle. Well, we'll finish our list before yes. we uh, move and, uh, on. The Girl the Scouts, the Boy Scouts, Cub Scouts, the antique car represent uh, and parade. The and the then fire apparatus. The fire apparatus. And now we're going back to Mike. Hello, Drake It. Here we are, live on the parade route, and the parade starting to head up here. And I found some more friends here along the parade route, and I have Ferris. Say hi, Ferris, to Drake It. Hi, Drake It. And Justin. Oh, hi, Drake It. All right, and you guys go to school in Drake It? Yeah, Richardson. Yeah. Richardson? Yeah, Richardson. Yeah. Uh, you want to say hi to anybody? Any teachers or anything? Uh, uh, Crazy Boy Fredo. Um, Gabe. Uh, oh, yeah. Gabe. Victor. Oh, yeah, the teacher for I. Yeah, I'm sure these guys are at home watching DATV right now, right? Yep. Right there, because nobody wants to miss the parade. Uh, Tim, Timothy. Tim Tim okay, how about teachers? You guys looking for A's? Oh, yeah, yeah. Uh, Mr. Mullen. Mr. Mullen. He's great. Mr. Malloy. Mr. Malloy, awesome. Uh, right, i got to say hi to these guys. Down here we have, did you want to say hi to anybody in Drake it? No? She's a little shy right now. And, and we have, who's this? Bo, look at this dog. What a cutie. Hey, Bo. <laughs> Bo's getting ready for the parade. I don't know if he's going to like the sirens when they come by, but... Um, and who's this over here? You want to say hi? He's kind of scared of the mic. It's like, a, like, a, like I'm threatening him. Here you go. <laughs> well, thanks for joining us. Um, here comes the parade. Um, we're going to send it back down to, to Gay and over at the uh, truck and get ready for thanks Mike thank you Mike we do see yes. the start of our program we always have a the lights in the horn everyone will I do see riding a bike ahead 
that loser. That could be the. That could be the. the oh, look. Up police come patrol. The on this monitor it does doesn't it it's really it's so yeah, nice to it's see nice to see them close yeah don't really get to see them up close and personal, talk about usually. them before they're right in front of us a I little know. bit they're wearing their dress blue uniforms always snazzy i Good do to see i them. see they're marching as well with I the do. police yeah that's ron What's wrong? Oh, the, the veterans are coming right, up the behind veterans them. Are yep. coming up right behind yep. them. Wow, this. Yeah, that must be one of our police. That yep, is, it is one of our police officers. Oh, he's got shorts on, Donna. So. That'll <laughs> <laughs> keep the blood flowing. Right. <laughs> Riding a bike. Drake Police Department currently has approximately 40 sworn officers. One chief, two deputy police chiefs, three full-time and ten part-time civilian dispatchers. Oh. One full-time and one part-time animal controller, one administrative secretary, two maintenance custodians, two records clerks, two school crossing guards, and our new chief, um, who is currently sworn in, is Peter Bartlett. And that is our Drake Police Department. Yep. Always good to see them marching in the parade. We met him this morning for the first time. I have not yet had the pleasure of meeting him, but I'm sure I will see him at some function that's going on. Oh, um, listen to the sirens, Donna. The kids always love the sirens, don't they? I kind of do, too. I kind of do, too. <laughs> you know, you never lose the kid and in And right there you know? in the front, as people can see, is right there on the uh, right-hand side of the camera is Officer Eric Kukos, oh, who wow. is the uh, school resource officer. Oh. So... Yeah, a lot of the kids will know him. They'll see Officer Eric, and they can tell him that they saw him marching in the parade. Oh, that's great! See, so they're waving uh, from the waving from the pad. side. They see Officer Eric. He knows them. He knows the kids. That's He's been a great addition. There's our, He's there's been, our there's new our chief, new right chief, there. chief Bartlett, there's and Chief Bartlett right there. Uh, behind them is the uh, deputy chiefs. Up. Oh. Yeah. <laughs> They're having a good time. They're they like seem to be having a great time. They are. They're having a great time. Good morning, Chief. Good morning, Chief. And following them is the Drake Fire Department. The fire department yep, currently has three fire stations, 43 firefighters, two, two deputy de chiefs, chiefs, one chief, and one administrative assistant. The chief is David uh, Bruyette. And some fundraisers that the Drake Fire Department participates in are the Firefighters Ball and the annual golf tournament. And oh, we love them. And look who, we, here comes Mr. And Gunther. And here comes Mr. Gunther in right his old-fashioned Drake it there fire truck. Do we know what year that is? There's Mr. Gunther. I don't know what year that is. Gary, our town manager. Town manager, Jim Duggan, Allison Hughes. School committee, new school committee school member, committee. Sabrina Heisey, Sabrina with some of the Heise. kids. Oh, look at what's coming up now, Donna. The Grand Marshal. The Grand Marshal. Here comes Frank. He oh, fought in World terrific. War II and was struck in the back by a piece of artillery shell, which he says went through him. He served with the 315th Infantry Regiment of the 79th Division of the Army. He has a Purple Heart, the World War II Victory Medal, and three Bronze Stars. de Guerre. Star Medal, and only he received the French Legion of Honor, which is France's highest military order. Since serving, he has done construction work on state roads, highways, and bridges, as well as excavating the tunnels, and later became the Green Line. Wow. He's 92 oh. years old and enjoys playing golf twice a week, and has a friend who is an ex-Marine. And here are our veterans. Our we veterans thank them right very now. much. Thank you for your service. Thank you them for their service. Thank you. Oh, look at this car. And look at this car. This, this is, is very awesome. Cool. <laughs> oh, all right. Here's the this Drake High School. They're under the direction of Zachary Cooper, performs a n number of events throughout the year. These performances take place both in the community and abroad. Just recently, the marching band performed on Main Street. Take a minute. All right.
that was good. That was awesome. Oh, that look sounded what we great. Have. Thank you. The now American Legion float. Right. The Drake and American Legion, Leo C. Roth, post 315, was organized under Massachusetts law in 1960. Membership is open only to men and women who served in active duty. Where I just lost my spot. In the U.S. Armed Forces. During and specific uh, periods designated as wartime. Right. By the U.S. Congress and who have who have received an honorable discharge or who are still serving honorably. Annually, the Legion raises funds by conducting events to support various community and veterans' causes. The local post has over 200 members and meets every except for July and August on the third Saturday of the month. Veterans are to attend. I've gone to the chicken barbecue. There's a and fundraiser. Here's, here's our this is the traveling this is the traveling soldier the traveling right here. traveling soldier. Dave. Here's our traveling soldier. Huh. Well, look at the tank. In the back. That's it cool. Plays. All right. What do we have coming up now, Donna? Now we have the Drake Public Schools being represented oh, here. here. We, we have, have the Campbell, Campbell Elementary School. Campbell Elementary School is one out in Kenwood. They are known as the Campbell Coyotes. Oh, are they? They are. Wow. And they have... Happy Memorial yeah, Day. Like, and then following them in the green is the, let's see, let's the see. Greenmont Avenue. Greenmont Avenue. School over in Drake at Center. Known as the Greenmont Gators, wearing oh. green, along with Greenmont. All right. Hi. They have a good representation of the elementary school. Following behind them is the Brookside Elementary School, the Brookside Bears, right here in Collinsville. Wow. Their school is in the back of the school complex, the Deolis complex. The Brookside Elementary School is down in the back. And then uh, I believe the Anglesby Eagles might be behind them. Oh, I like their oh. hats. I know. Look at their That's hats. Everybody's cool. not. Everybody's having a they good time are, oh, out here. Kind of nice he's, got, hat. he's got glasses to match yours, Gay. <laughs> that little guy right there. I on. He's got I his glasses him. to match yours. The kids are having a great <laughs> time. And it, it's actually, oh, now here we, here we have the um, Liberty Jazz Band. Liberty Jazz Band. The new Liberty Jazz Band, 1980, in based out of Pelham, New Hampshire. Their seven piece Dixieland Band. Oh, we love this music. We love this music. They performed all around New England, concerts, parades, and special functions. They performed at Jazz Fest in Connecticut and New York. That was Coming terrific. up is the Drake at Lions Club. That was terrific. The Drake at Lions Club is a service-based organization. They participate in eyeglass recycling project in which they collect eyeglasses to refurbish and deliver to those who cannot afford glasses of their own. Well, there I are sure drop-off of boxes around town. You can see them at the post office. They also work with the Red Cross to organize blood cross uh, blood drives. Good morning, Drake at Lions. There we go. Everybody's looking good this morning. Yeah. What do we have next, Anna? My papers are stuck. We, this is, again, the Lions Club. This is their float. Oh, this is their yep. float. Okay. Oh, look Charlie at this. Charlie K. Driving the lion. The, yep. Driving the... <laughs> that is so cool. And this... Uh, well, here, here you go. Okay. This is the Whispering Brook Farmed Horse Drawn Hearse. Oh. Oh boy. boy. A little somber moment here. Yeah. Uh, exactly. The parade. What a gorgeous horse though. Look at that. Look at that beauty. You know, actually um, one of one of our relatives actually, unfortunately, was in that hearse. Well, you know, in the they took in him to the cemetery in that. Wow. But look at the and Clydesdale. The time, instead of wakes at homes, they this is Look what at the they Clydesdale. Used. I, I mean, thought they gorgeous horse. Beautiful horse. Beautiful. Here comes the Drake Girl Softball. Drake Girls Softball Association being represented by a, a lot of teams out there. I see the Junior League. I see some of the Senior League. 
Um, I'm out there two, three nights a week. Are out you? at the Monahan Field. My granddaughter plays softball. She has a wonderful time. The girls are awesome. That's we cool. have so much fun. Um, they have a regular season and a summer season. They team respect. They have a great work ethic, goals, self-confidence, discipline. Quite a few girls come out and play Look softball. Look at all these girls. They have so a what, good what, time. What position did uh, Jalen plays uh, catcher and um, out in right field, and she plays for the uh, Drake at Middies, actually. Oh. It's the Guiding Light Dance Academy. Wow. They offer classes in ballet, lyrical, tap, dance, and hip hop. The dance company is also comprised of dancers studying ballet, dance, and tap, jazz, and tap. The company performs at community events. Right, following them is the Jim Kilroy's Jambalaya Jazz Band. All Let's right. listen to them for a moment. Absolutely. They are based out of Salem, Mass, and they are riding in a New Orleans bandwagon. Love that music. Okay. Oh, they sound great, don't they? They sound they great. Sound I love wonderful. this music. Here comes the Girl Scouts. Here they come. They were They're founded in 1912 and perhaps best known for their delicious cookies. I was a Girl Scout. I was a brownie. Yeah, I would. I, uh, yeah, I went through not brownies, but I did Girl Scout juniors and cadets. And we have several troops in Drake. It and yes. their mission is to build girls of courage, confidence, and character who make the world a better place. And they certainly do. And they they have participate in many volunteer program projects, such as the Wish Project, the Candles to Crayons, and they work in the local food pantry. Oh, nice program. It's a great program. Keeps there are six six age levels of Girl Scouts actually: Daisy, Brownie, Junior, Cadet, Senior, and Ambassador. Wow. The Drake Girl Scouts participate in many volunteer projects such as the Wish Project, Candles to Crayons, and working with food pantries. I've seen them working in the food pantry. Really? Great job. That, that's commendable to see these kids get involved in it things sure like is. that. I oh, love and they it. have a float. Look at that. They have the poppies of they Flanders. They have the poppies of Flanders fields. That's awesome. That is. That is a great float, girls. Congratulations on that. You win the prize. <laughs> you definitely win the float prize beautiful. of the day. That's beautiful. Thank you so much for representing. Colors are vivid. It's beautiful. Coming up is the Boy Scouts. All right, the Cub Scouts and the Boy Scouts aim to provide a program for young people that builds character, trains them in responsibilities of participating in citizenship, and develops personal fitness. Cub Scouts. Four age groups, tigers, wolf, bear, and weevilos. Then they become Boy Scouts, and then they earn their ranks, which are scout, tenderfoot, second class, first class, star, Life and finally Eagle. The Drake Boy Scouts sell flowers for Mother's Day and participate in many other activities. We have many Eagle Scout projects in town. We have uh, some of the trails have been done. Some of the trails have been done by Eagle Scouts here in Drake. It. The, there's uh, my buddy Michael. There's Michael. Yay, that's my buddy. So um, cute. I've been on a couple of the trails in town through the uh, Did you? conservation land. Uh, laid out by Eagle Scouts of Drake. It. They also did the gazebo out on uh, oh, Polly's Corner. Nice. Was so an Eagle Scout project. So what do we have now? Still the Scouts. Still the Scouts. Oh, they're quite quite a big group. Oh, there's they a canoe. Are. We may need one of those later on today, Donna. A canoe? Yeah, yeah. I think the rains are supposed to come in this canoe afternoon. Come canoe come to the parade. Canoe. <laughs> I know. A go. corny uh, joke. I Sorry, know, I, I had know, to I do it. I know. Had to do it. And um, then these are there we go. There's Joe Greenwood. There's Joe Greenwood. And Bud Gunther. There's and, the yeah. And Bud Gunther. There's the uh, very nice old fashioned. And here's the parade of cars. Oh. These are the antique cars. Some are members of the Road Runners. Some <laughs> are members of uh, just residents in town who own these vehicles. There are several types of models represented. There's mu muscle cars, there's Chevys, there's Dodges. Oh, my favorite, the Ford Mustang is coming up shortly. Uh, you like that, huh? Oh, I do. I do. My favorite, Ford Galaxy. Oh, Ford Galaxy. That is so cool. Well, I have, a, I have a Corvette. I know you have a Corvette. I had a Mustang. It was you my did? favorite car as a kid. Yeah, that it's was my favorite car. It's not too late to get another one. Well, you know, I just might one of these days. <laughs> I just might. One of these days always been my favorite car to have. Now, what's this coming up? Uh, what kind of car is that? That's a Cougar. Oh, that's a Cougar? 
Wow. Those are cool cars. Very cool. <laughs> and some look, of the look at the muffler. I know. Yeah. Well, I guess you don't have to, I pa don't, I don't don't have uh, to pass emissions <laughs> on those. <laughs> <laughs> no, I need to work out, get up and work on my uh, car <laughs> recognition. We'll have to get them to t let us know what they're all driving. <laughs> so what is this? It's just uh, an old truck? Oh, this is coming up. Bob, is, is this a, a Ford, Ford Fairlane coming up here? The <gasps> oh, this oh is that's a already gone. No. What, what is this one? Oh. Model A? Oh, Model A. Or is it, I don't know if it's that far back. What is it? What is that, Bob? Well, it's got an eagle on it. Oh. It does have an eagle on it. What? And, and uh, lest we forget, we need to thank Barbara Souza and her, oh, and oh, gee. <laughs> <laughs> Thought we had a little That's fender going bender on the, the avenue of here, you know. <laughs> we do need to thank, thank Barbara, Barbara Sousa and, for her and and her granddaughter Emily for her for devotion into uh, putting all these this years parade, and putting together. The parade together. What a fantastic job she's done! And coming thank up you, at the this end, thank you, Barbara. And coming up we at the end is the Drake Fire Department. Yeah. Their equipment ladder one. And I think. I think we're nearing the end of the and parade. We are Donna. nearing the end of the parade, so we we'll ask that. everybody who is out here on the route to please follow down to the follow down to the monument at the Fred St uh, Frederick Street parking lot, where there'll be a short short ceremony, ceremony over there uh, by the American Legion, and uh, <laughs> where Mike is coming over. We're going to be is signing off. Over, yeah. We're going to be gonna signing off sign together off. over we here. We thank you very much, Drake, for joining us for this Absolutely. morning. Absolutely. Thank you, Drake Day at Parade. Access. Thank you, Drake at Access. The parade oh, went over wonderful. Mike, thank you for thank you. For thank you, Mike. Your, your man you on the street. Fun? That was a lot of fun. That was a lot of fun. I have the mic. You have the mic. Great time. <laughs> Loved it. We beat we the did. rain. We, we did beat the, beat rain. the rain. That's right. We did. And right. uh, we thank you very much for joining us at home. We hope you enjoyed the parade. This is a lot of fun for us a for our fun. first time. On behalf of DATV, we say Absolutely. thank you very much for joining us. Thanks for the crew. Thanks for uh, Mike and, and uh, Nate and um, Tyler, I believe, is in there, too. And, yep. and thank you, Gary and uh, Ron. And Ron. Hello. For doing all. <laughs> and hello, Nate. And Nate's, and hello, Nate. <laughs> Nate's giving his stretches. Nate's doing the <laughs> hottest job running around. <laughs> thank you, Nate. You're doing a great job. You did a great job, you I should say. You did a great job. Thank well, you thank so you much. thank you all for joining thank us. We hope you enjoyed it. Oh, there's Bob. Thank you, veterans. Oh, there's thank Bob. Thank you, veterans. Bob is a veteran. Bob's a veteran. <laughs> he is. I he am a veteran. You are. Thank you for your service. And thank Bob, you thank you, you as always. All right. All right well, we're going to head up to the, to we, the uh, monument we now. We beat the rain. Yay. <laughs> Job, Mike. Thank you. you nice job, job with you guys. Thank you. It was a lot of fun. Good. Goodbye, good Drake. Day. And how about Gay's glasses? Those are awesome. Aren't awesome? they awesome? <laughs> awesome? I wish I had a pair. Mike, <laughs> Mike, Mike decorated us all this morning. <laughs> he comes That's what I do. With all of his. Goodbye. Bye. Thanks for joining us. Thanks for joining us. <laughs>